It is so hard to find a cave in a snowstorm. And that's that's not metaphorically speaking. <laughs> Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to Let's Play The Long Dark. My name is Weasel. We are in the Trapper's Homestead. Uh, we just got some fresh deer hide and guts, which I'm probably going to drop on the floor so it can be cured. Um, and yeah, we have some, some, some good stuff with us so far. Uh, we have plenty of cloth because we broke down a chair. So what I would like to do is repair... Yeah, like repair my socks uh, during the night. Uh, we can do that right now, I think. And then take care of my stats, maybe sleep a little bit, repair more. Um, you know what, it's, it's still three hours of daylight left. I don't even see... Honestly, I don't even see a reason to stay here overnight. Um, might, might, might be a little bit safer, and if I sleep an hour, I warm up, so I'm gonna keep on my clothing. Um, but I think we're gonna, yeah, we're gonna head out in a little bit. Uh, I'm just gonna rest for an hour. That should warm me up a little bit, and then we have two hours of daylight left. Probably enough to get back to camp office. That's where I would really like to stay. There's my other stuff. Um, yeah, we're warm now. A little tired, maybe, but that's okay. Uh, we could try to start a fire and give ourselves some coffee. Actually, that's a good idea. Let's, let's do that. Let's drink some coffee before we head out. Gonna use a tinder plug 67%. That's percent higher than last time because we increased our skill. So let's hope that works. And if you guys have uh, been coming new to the series and might be wondering why do you only have three uh, or four items of clothing, it's because we started with nothing in this series. And uh, that's been quite interesting so far. Um, it's an interesting, interesting start. The stuff that I started with is in a cave, I think an Alan's cave. I don't intend to grab it. Um, Oh, did I start it with a... Oh, I started it with, um... Fur firewood. I should have used a stick. Ah, that's fine. We can cook our venison real quick. And then our coffee. And hopefully have enough time to head home. Might might be a little late. Okay, not melting any snow. I'm gonna make myself a coffee. Waking myself up. Warming myself a little bit. And then we're gonna head to camp office. Alright, very good. We have a warmth bonus. We have a, uh, I guess, tired bonus. Awakeness bonus, whatever you want to call it. So let's go ahead and grab the reclaimed wood. I'd like to take that with me. The tinder plug, the guts, and the height. We're not encumbered. That's a win in my books. Oh, bandage, antiseptic, and some tinder plugs. I totally missed that. Okay, I think we got everything out of this place. So it's what? What's that? Okay, it's just just a light thing. Just light. So, look at that time. One hour of daylight left. <laughs> uh, I would say YOLO, but... Um, <laughs> I'm pretty sure I would regret it. Okay, that wolf leaves us alone. Okay, we're gonna have to uh, hurry up a little bit to make it back. I have clear sight, so I'm not too worried about running for a little bit. Running would worry me if I would attract a wolf, because then I would have to use one of my remaining flares. Of course, we're gonna not gonna run all the way through, because if I had no stamina left, and then it would be a wolf. That would not be a fun time. If I have full stamina and a wolf approaches me, we can still make it out of there. It's still quite possible. Okay, actually... I should be fine when I head this direction. Hopefully. Yeah, that's that's how adventures always start. Let's go another way. Let's see where this leads. No, I think this should bring us back to the railroad track eventually. Okay, at least we see something. I do think that the railroad track is over <sighs> here. I do hear wolf. I hope that wolf didn't see me or hear me. All right, we're clear. So far. Okay, we're back on track. We're back at our little hut. Very nice. That means tracks are up there. And we should be in camp office in no time. And we're still warm, thanks to the coffee. Oh yes, coffee. You delicious beverage. Damn it, now I want a coffee. I've played over, I want to say, 70 hours in this game already. And, you know, a weather like this still makes me nervous. The atmosphere in this game is <sighs> really fantastic. I would really love to play this in the Oculus Rift. I would really love that. If this game got Oculus Rift support. Man, fighting a wolf would be terrifying. Okay, I think we're gonna make it, no problem. Camp office should be right behind there. Ah, no, oh, that's a limb. There's a stick, gimme. Okay, we're encumbered. Oh no, really? 
That really right between me and the hut. All right, run. Run, 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 run. All right, let's let's fake out the AI and we're in. Whew. <laughs> that was close. All right, it's time to make some light. Bring some light in this darkness. Very good. Okay, so we have some guts curing down here, which means we're going to drop our rest as well, some more guts. I need to make myself some wolf clothing. That should be the next goal. I only have two bullets and I would love to preserve them for emergencies. Maybe we can make ourselves a bow. Okay, I don't have anything to cook right now. Just, I have a little bit of meat that needs cooking. Oh, never mind. I already cooked that, right? I remember I cooked that in the uh, Trapper's Homestead. So pretty much we could just, yeah, sleep through the night. And start fresh in the next morning. All right, let's take off our clothing. Very important. We don't want that stuff to deteriorate. And I think... Yeah, five hours of sleep. Then we're gonna work a little bit in the night, repair our stuff, and then sleep another few hours. All right, we have no idea how many hours of darkness are left. Probably six or so. It's not gonna give me too much warmth, and if we find a coat, that thing becomes useless pretty much. But I'd much rather have a good vest right now than risking not having enough warmth on me. Um, I don't think the flea sweater is worth repairing for 30%, but... I'll do it anyway. Every little bit counts here right now. While we're at it, we're going to create some uh, tinder plaques from our new sprint. Now, oh, four hours of darkness left, so we got some time to do all of this. Okay, very good. We have 21 tinder plugs right now. That's that's plenty, I would say. That's plenty of tinder plugs. Our hatchet is uh, not hatchet. Our hunting knife is at 81%. Hatchet at 80. One as well. So what we're gonna do, we're gonna sharpen them. I think uh, sharpening the hatchet first is a good idea. It's just going to take some time, but that should bring it up to a nice high percentage again. The higher your sharpening skill is, uh, the shorter it takes. Um, currently it's at 33, which is not too high. I assume it gets faster over time. Currently sharpening 3% onto your uh, knife or axe takes 10 minutes. Now it only takes nine minutes. Ah, you see, the skill really helps. <laughs> the hunting knife takes a little bit longer to sharpen. 17 minutes for 4%, which is interesting that it's different from the axe in that regard. Oh, I didn't even notice that I was dehydrated. And I'm even cold. Oh yeah, probably because I've been standing around naked in this place at minus three. So I'm freezing and I'm thirsty. Good job. Uh, which means I'm gonna need some sleep uh, to make up for that. That's okay. It's okay. <laughs> We learn, don't stand around naked, even in a building. Uh, we're a little bit hungry, so I'm gonna eat some cattail stalks. Mmm, delicious. I wonder what they taste like, I never had one in my life. Alright, beautiful. Survived for two days and 18 hours. Um, I'm a little colder, that is okay. I'm alright with that. I'm gonna go down and drop a few things on the floor. I would really like to go to Carter Hydro Dam now, that we have the rifle with two bullets, so we can take care of Fluffy, Fluffy, Fluffy. The wolf that usually roams around there. It's always scary, but it's also all worth it. I'm gonna drop my magnifying lens and the whetstone. This is my base of operation now. So, um, one tip I can give is to drop your items in light. So you don't have to use your fuel to find things on the floor. Drop, drop. I will take the food with me just in case. And I think I'm gonna drop most of the sticks. I think 40 sticks are too much. 10 will do. They will warm me up in case of an emergency. I'm gonna find some anyway. Oh, I dropped them all. Good, good, good job, Weasel. All right, we got eight sticks. That's okay. Works fine with me. Let's put on some clothing. I'm, I'm still not wearing anything. I'm still completely naked. I'm a little chilled and hungry as well. Let's have a quick look outside and see how it's going. If it's really windy and stormy outside, I'm gonna stay inside and make myself a coffee and hope this blows over. Um, yeah, it is quite windy, actually. It's not a full-blown blizzard, but it feels like minus 28. Yeah, I, I, I wouldn't survive very long outside. So we're gonna have to wait until the wind is gone. So we might or make ourselves some, uh, food. Ah, coffee. Use one of my 21 tinderplex to start the fire. Ah, and we got a fire going. Uh, it's, I guess one stick will... Ah, let's add two sticks just to be on the safe side. And, oh, pinnacle peaches. You know what, I'm gonna heat myself up some pinnacle peaches. Um, yeah, I'm gonna smash the can, that's okay. Hopefully not losing too much in the process. How much do we lose when we smash a can? Uh, 18%, okay, never mind, I should have used the hatchet or knife in this case. Ah, well, what can you do? 
Anyway, let's eat some delicious warm peaches. Yum! All right, I'm happy with this. Let's see how the wind is going. The warmth bonus will hopefully help. Still feels like minus 26. You know, if I go if I go fast enough, I could do this, but there's the wolf coming. And mm, no, no, I'm gonna I'm gonna have to wait this out. I won't be able if I'm running, I might warm up a little bit, but it's not gonna be enough. Uh, I'm gonna sleep for another hour. Hopefully the wind blows over and we can head out. I'm going to go for the passage near Mystery Lake. We could also look for a possible bunker location. Okay, we still got that one wolf roaming the area. I'm not a fan. Just letting you know. But I'm heading out. I want to go to Cotter Hydra Den. If I take a hit on health, that's okay. I'll try to walk uh, in the wind protected areas. That means like right next to rocks and such. Okay, as long as the wolf doesn't see me, I'm good. I can walk on the side here okay buddy go and go and hunt a deer or so why would you walk around in the friggin cold wind you really do not give a fuck don't you Eh, we're okay we're okay protected from the wind where it's not going down as much then out in the open obviously the possible bunker location is pretty much straight ahead and i'm gonna see if i Go there now or later, depending on my situation. Come on, buddy, you gotta go faster. I genuinely don't have all day. I genuinely don't. Go and hunt a deer over there. There's a deer. Yeah, go and yeah, hunt your prey. Okay, as long as I don't run, I think I'm fine. Hope it stays that way. Yeah, you do. You mind your own business, sir. Sir, we could go fishing. That that is a thing I haven't done yet. Okay, so this path would lead me to Carter Hydro Dam. I'm gonna run for now um, because I see no wolf close by, and I'm going to look for the bunker. Let's risk it. Here goes nothing. How how, how can I not get up there? Oh, hi wolves. Okay, here we go. Now, if you follow this ridge straight ahead and then go a little bit to the left. You might find a bunker or not. I've seen people finding bunker in this location and other let's plays. I have never found it myself here. So I don't have my hopes up too high. It's random if they spawn or not. It should come up on the left here somewhere. It's just a little hatch in the ground, so it's really hard to find, even if you know where it is. At least we get a beautiful view, but I don't think we're gonna find a bunker. Well, it was worth a try. Risking my life for that. At least it was- Oh, damn it. Sprained ankle, sprained wrist. Good job. Uh, I'm gonna have to take those. I only have- I have eight left. Really for the sprain- I don't, I don't care about the sprained wrist, honestly. I honestly don't care about that one. Going down the sill here. Okay, this is the path that should bring us to Cotter Hydro Dam. Oh, I'm very cold. I'm so cold and I have a sprained wrist. Can I still hold my rifle? Oh, you cannot equip a weapon while having a sprained wrist. Okay, I'm gonna have to treat that wound. Because I'm not gonna be able to encounter the wolf without having a weapon. Ooh! Is this Alan's cave? Is this where we started? Okay, give me give me the lichen. No, I'm cold. Like, give me that stuff. I'll take all the things. Thank you very much. Okay, no, we started somewhere else. This is uh this is Alan's cave, but then I think I might have started somewhere else. Sometimes confuse these places. Cave is a cave is a cave. Crow feathers, yay for arrows. Okay, how much meat? 1.3 kilograms. Oh, I would love it. I could have a little fire running next to the deer. Okay, what do we have here? Ooh, a rifle round, perfect. We're gonna break down that bench, that's silly. Rifle cleaning kit, yes. Energy bar, an MRE, fantastic. That's food for nearly a whole day. Okay, while I'm here, I might as well pick up some sticks real quick. Oh, that wolf is eating the deer. Huh. If I kill the wolf, I get both. But they're so far away from everything. Hmm. Choices, choices, choices. Here goes nothing. I need a wolf pelt anyway. Hey, man. Hey. Hey, you enjoying your deer? You're, you're enjoying your delicious, delicious deer? You want to protect it? Right in the head. Very good. 6.3 kilograms meat, one... Oh, that's perfect. All right, we're gonna start a fire here, right in the snow. Oh, I can't start a fire next to the deer. Oh, I'm doomed. Oh, horrible. That is absolutely horrible. Okay, seems like I'm gonna have to come back to this. Because I really want the wolf pelt, but I... Without a fire? <sighs> okay, let's, let's stay outside. Let's do this. 
You know what? I'm not accepting this. I must be able to make a fire closer. Totally works. You just gotta have some trust. And also find the right angle to place it down. It's about millimeters here. There you go. You know what? Start a fire. Let's see. Maybe we get lucky without accelerant. I'd like to keep it. We're gonna have to break down some sticks and it looks like we have a storm picking up. But I don't want to leave any meat behind or hide or anything. That's too good to pass up. And while the wolf is not completely frozen, it's faster as well. If we come back later, the whole wolf is going to be frozen and we're going to have a hard time getting the meat from him. Alright, that worked great. Add all the fuel. We're going to need pretty much all of it. First things first, we're going to make ourselves a coffee. What? Six minute duration? What happened? Why, why, why is it just embers? Oh, it's a snowstorm. Okay. Okay, yeah, I... That's not good. I'm in trouble, ladies and gentlemen. I'm in the worst trouble possible. We have a hot cup of coffee. So everything's good with coffee, right? We're gonna have to come back. There's no way I'm surviving this. Shit. Break it down. Give me the sticks. Cedar limb takes me 45 minutes. I can risk it. Yeah, I'm gonna have to risk it. Got some firewood, we got some tinder plucks. I'm not getting back home, this is not happening. Oh, you're hungry? Really? That's... Let's break it down. Alright, hypothermia kicking in, good. I need, sadly, all of this. Luckily, we have a cave nearby, remember? I just gotta find it. Wait, where is it? Oh, no. I need to find food. Really? That's what you need to find right now? You need to find friggin' shelter. There was a cave nearby and I can't find it for the life of me right now. I'm walking in a big, huge circle. Oh, really? Because of the hypothermia? Or because you're freezing to death? Or what is it? Pick one. Oh, no good, no good, no good. No good. Jeez, where's the cave? It is so hard to find a cave in a snowstorm. And that's, that's not metaphorically speaking. Okay, here's a path that means the cave should be on the left side, right? Oh, okay, we found the cave. No, wait, is that the, yeah, that's the cave. This is Ellen's cave. Means we're protected a little bit from the wind. I'm gonna sit here in the corner. I'm gonna start a fire somewhere. Come on, I need a fire. As long as I'm protected from the wind, I'm okay with this. All right, here you go, accelerant. I'm not gonna risk it. We need to start the fire. All right, six hours. I can make myself a coffee to warm myself up. I do have some food with me. Man, it got dark in my room. I didn't even realize it. Um, okay. Very fitting to the atmosphere. All right, we're warming up. Good. Okay, I'm also tired. I'm drained. I'm hungry. Uh, I'm gonna eat the MRE. Okay, there's a really realistic chance that we're gonna have to sit this out throughout the whole night. I don't know how long this is gonna last. Ah, uh, 39. Degrees warm bonus. We're warming up really nicely next to it. I could clearly sleep an hour next to it and warm, wake up a little bit. And this is actually what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna rest for one hour right next to the fire. That should keep me nice and warm. The blizzard won't be gone at this point, but at least I won't be super exhausted anymore. As you can see, it's really late and dark. I'm warm, just dr super drained. I'm still going out. I already have hypothermia. I'm encumbered from what? Oh, because I'm tired, that's why. I'm so tired I can't run anymore. Break down those branches. Any kind of firewood that I can get my hands on right now. I need it. No, don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. We got this. Alright. Um, Eight minutes to break down the crate. Oh, jeez. Down to 20%. Okay, that's no good. That is not good at all. Risky business. Risky business. And any stick I can get. This is the cave here, there. I think this is the cave. Okay. We can extinguish that. Okay, it's all good. We're not gonna die. We're at 15%. It looks horrible. But we got this. This is intense. At fuel. Okay, we got five. We got nearly six hours of sleep here. It's really warm next to it. Which means we're gonna warm up. And I'm going to sleep for four hours. I can only hope that four hours is gonna bring my condition up a little bit. 24%. The storm is over. Okay, good. The campfire is gonna go on for three more hours. I'm gonna cook myself a coffee. I'm running out of coffee though. How long, how many more potions is in there? In the, in the thing. Mm, I think seven more or so. Whew, that was intense. All right, we're gonna drink the coffee because we need it. I'm a little bit too far away to head back to camp office, I feel. I mean, if I find some wood outside right now at night, 
I can stay here overnight, no problem. I mean, it feels like minus 10 because we got the warmth bonus. If I find some limbs to chop down, I could do it. I could make it. There is a big limb that I'm going to chop down. Very good. That's what I need. Cedar limbs gonna take me 45 minutes. Very good. Three of those. I'll take them. Thank you very much. And we're gonna head back. Thanks, footprints. Bring me back home. That means we can keep the fire going for a little bit longer. Five and a half hours. That's all I need. That means I'm gonna sleep for four more hours. Oh, I picked it up. I'm gonna sleep here. Ah, uh, four hours. Yes. Good. Good idea. Okay, we have two hours of darkness left. We have hypothermia. We're a little bit tired. Um, I'm gonna make myself a coffee and I think um, We might head out even if it's the middle of the night That's too dark right now with the moonlight it would have been possible, but yeah, I think we survived most of the night I don't know what's gonna happen in the next one. Our condition is not looking good. We got caught in the blizzard I got greedy. I wanted the stuff from the wolf wanted all the meat. That is what you get We still have to harvest that wolf and that deer um, I, I would really love to have that, but not in my condition. It's really, yeah, it's not feasible. Anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching uh, this episode. I hope you enjoyed it. That was nail biting, at least for me. And I hope to see you guys in the next one. I'm Weasel. I'm out. And I hope to see you around. Burnt. 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 Burnt.